Hello folks, this is Christine. Thank you for joining Smart Noise and learning how to sign up for your free SurveyMonkey account. If you would like to go for a professional account and you want to have unlimited surveys, responses, better represented analysis and other data, you can go for the pro sign up right away. However, if you're not sure yet and just want to have a look, click the sign up for free button. You still can change your mind and upgrade at a later point. Here you can see, choose a username, choose a password, retype password and enter your contact email. Just make sure your username doesn't have any spaces in it. Or alternately, you can directly sign up with Facebook. Uh, I can only recommend this for small companies or perhaps people who are freelancers. Uh, like I am and you'll be able to see that it directly jumps in my existing account because I'm already signed in with Facebook. When you've logged in or you've pressed the connect with the Facebook button you will come directly onto your my service tab which is basically showing all the service you already have. You can then create a new survey anywhere from this page. So let's say you're on the home or the survey services section, you can always press the green plus create survey button and that is how you create your first survey. You can change from three different options which is create a new survey and in this case I would call it for example customer feedback. You can copy an existing survey or you can use an expert survey template. If you press copy an existing survey it means you're referring to an old survey you already have and you just want to slightly modify it. If you press use an expert survey template it will lead you to professional surveys that have been pre-organized. Let's say you're in the education sector you could pick this. It will give you templates such as child behavior, bullying surveys, all these kind of things. Once you've clicked on this it will lead you to the questions that will be asked, a preview of those, and then you can continue from there. And this is how you set up your SurveyMonkey account and how you can get started creating your first survey.